Hey everybody, this is Mr. G, and we are here uh, doing a Let's Play of Cats in Japan. Without any further ado, I'm going to play the game. Uh, I found this game on congregate.com, and you just type in Cats in Japan. Um, and who doesn't love cats? I guess people that don't love cats. <laughs> Several students just said they didn't love cats. I'm doing this live. All right, Cats in Japan. Now we're going to turn the music on. Ah, there's a nice... Uh, the Japanese inspired music and a bowl of sushi. This cat wants all the sushi. The goal of the game, I guess, is to find 20 sushi. So here we go. I'm going to try to find 20 sushi. Well, that wasn't so hard. That wasn't so hard. I've already found three. Oh, I've only found two of 20. There's my indicator. Uh, I guess I'm going to click on stuff. Oh, they wobble. Awesome. Nope, nothing. Oh, pillow. Hey, sushi. Oh, dolls. Oh, poltergeist. I am possessed! Okay, I, it doesn't do anything. And I can't click on those, so I guess I use these arrow keys. Yeah. Oh, I got a thing. Oh, a sushi! And a mouse hole. And a little mousy welcome mat. Alright, I'm gonna use these arrows. I don't know what happens. Oh, hey, look! Sushi! 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 Towels. The towels don't do anything. Oh, sushi! It's a little fat cat. He's not, he's not doing anything. There's buttons. There we go. I'm clicking the buttons and magical things are happening and it's great. He's waving his hands at me, but nothing's happening. So I'm going to leave this here. Ooh, I turned on the water. Oh, look, a thing. I have a gong and a thing. All right. I'm not sure what to do with these things. All right. I guess that doesn't do anything. Oh, the door's locked. And there's a key. There's a T. Oh, sushi. Nope. Yeah, sushi. There's a tree. Oh, a cute little tree. I don't know what to do with the tree. There's some buttons that I don't know why I'm pressing them. All right. Oh, sushi. A key. Oh, a key. Oh, I want to go back and put the key in there. How about there? Yes. Okay, now what? Oh. Ah, you open the door. Oh, look! It's magical! So, uh, yeah, so this is a, it's like an escape game, kind of. And, uh, except I'm not escaping from anywhere. I'm trying to find sushi. I like the music. It's fun. There's not much in the way of sound effects. But, uh, anyway, there's the game. Okay, I'm back. I, uh, if, if it looks like I wasn't gone, I, w I was gone. And I, I came, I returned. Uh, I was, uh, yeah, anyway. So, we're back, and I'm looking for sushi, and I can't wait. And every time I find sushi, I'm going to eat a sweet tart, because I want a real-life reward for when I find one. So I'm, I'm looking for sushi like a man who wants to eat sweet tarts. And, okay, so right now, if I'm looking at the screen, I see pink, blue, and yellow, and I see pink, kind of orange, and, and, uh, and uh, blue. So I think these match. Uh... See, it's pink and then blue. So I'm going to try to put, I see there's a design when I flip these. So I'm going to match the design. This looks like a, like a uh, backward C. Okay. And then that one uh, looks like a dot, the yellow or orange. So I'm just going to go to the dot. And the other one looks like a, like an L or maybe it's a C. Oh, hey, 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 Suji. Awesome. Got my sushi. Got my doll head. And a piece of cheese. Oh, and I remember that there's a hole. Probably a mouse hole. And I bet I put the cheese there. Eat the cheese, mouse. Eat the cheese. He's not coming out. Okay, but I can go up here and I can put a doll head. Ooh, there's two doll heads. Spin, doll head, spin. <laughs> okay, that's not doing anything. Can I hit them? Can I? All right, all right. So, oh, oh, there's a sushi. He's a sneaky little mouse. Who's a sneaky little mouse? All right. Uh, there's nothing else there. All right. So, ah, oh, sushi. What's that? There's a thing. Oh, look at that. There's a design. Okay. Hey, these look 
like that. So, okay. Oh, so the first one's going to point to the right, like that. The next one's going to point diagonally down. And then the next one's going to point diagonally up. And the la first one, I don't know. What was it? Going to point to the left. <gasps> Yay! Sushi! Sweet dad! Ow. I got my sushi. And, oh. Put the music back on. And a head. Awesome. So all these dresses have weird designs and I have a feeling those are all related to puzzles in the game there's a drawer here I can't open um one two three four oh I can click on them and they turn on uh I can only click on them once it looks like four okay there's six boxes and there's six six things here and they're dice uh and it's three, five, one, two, four, six. So there's odds and evens. Maybe if I turn on just the odds. Did I do anything? No. What if I try on just the evens? It's not opening. Okay. One, two, three. If I do these in order. One, two, three, four, five. Can I remember that? One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, I think I got it. One. Wait. Two, three, four, five, six. Oh, yeah. Doll head. I got two doll heads now. I'm rocking the doll heads. Let's go put these doll heads back where they belong. Doll head. Boom. <gasps> Yay. Doll heads everywhere. Ooh, I wonder. See this? The dress. They're like the doll heads, and they're pointing different directions, but I don't have all the doll heads. But, so one points to the right, right, forward, blank. How do I do blank? Okay, so that's facing right, forward. I guess, I guess that's blank. What's the fourth one supposed to be? Forward. So I'm gonna put the fourth one facing forward. Ooh, I just need to find one more doll head. I wonder what these guys, what are they there for? Have I already done that puzzle? Hey, look at me. I can raise my hands. I can raise my hand. I can raise my hand. Nope, not doing anything. All right. I got the water. I filled the water. Uh, this is a puzzle where you turn stuff. And I don't see anything that looks like that in here. I mean, maybe the towels. There's nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, it doesn't seem to... Hmm click on the cat. Maybe I click on something different. No. I can't click on the box part. It doesn't open. Oh, there's a lump. Head. I found another head. Yes. What, where's that head supposed to be? Uh, facing left. Awesome. Head. Boom. Yes. Light bulb sushi. I have another sushi. I have 16 of 20. Oh. Ow. Food jar. All right. I have several items. Ooh, that's a lantern. I bet the light bulb goes in there. Ah, it's a nice pattern. Ah, that's this pattern. Up, middle, right. Up. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, crud, I have to go back and look. This is, this is tough. Up, uh, wait, I guess up, horiz uh, vertical, horizontal, to the right. So vertical, horizontal, to the right. That's the first one. Then it's left, right, left. Left, right, left. All right, I was gone, but I'm back. And my, oh, my thing is missing. Hold on, I don't see where my cam, there it is, there's my camera. Okay. So we are playing this game. It's called, what is it called? Yes, Cats in Japan. And we're in Japan, and I have this thing I'm drawing with, and I don't know why I'm drawing with it. Oh, look, there's an arrow. I want to turn that feature off. How do I turn that off? 
There we go. Okay. So uh, this puzzle, it took me a while to figure out what that puzzle was, but I discovered that once I, once I got the light bulb out of this case, I put the light bulb in the lantern and the lantern has directions on it. So now I'm going to do this, the slant to the right, slant to the left and center. I'm going to go back. Oh, missed the puzzle. Here it is. Slant to the left, slant to the right. Oh, that wasn't it. Other way. Dang it. Uh, I have to go look again. Left, slant to the right. Oh, slant to the right, slant to the left, center. Okay. Slant to the left, slant to the right. Other way. Is that it? Which one's wrong? Okay, one of these is wrong, people. Hold up, let's go back, look. Okay, left, right, left, right? Left, right. Oh, I think my middle one's wrong, huh? Down, down, so it makes a V. It's kind of like a mountain, like a... Oh, this one's wrong. <gasps> and it opened, and look, sushi. Oh, and pliers. Okay, I've got sushi and pliers. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with sushi and pliers. Okay, let's find out, let's find out. So, um, over here, oh, I forgot to do this. You put the gong here. Ah, and then this is the thing that you hit the gong with. And it goes bong. And there's a lucky clover. And I put the lucky clover in the cat. Here you go, lucky cat. Oh, so to open, hold on, hold on. Because I'm doing this as a let's play. I'm doing this with my students in the classroom, so they're giving me advice. But I want to tell you, if you're watching this at home, that if you go to the closet, there's all these like kimonos and each one has a clue on it. This one has arrows, just like that cat had two arrows. So it's left, right, left, left, right, right, left, right, left. Okay, so let's see if I can remember that. And I'll get help if I don't get it. So it's left, right, left, left, right, right, left, right. Hey, it opened. Now I bet I put this thing here. And magic. Oh, great. Another puzzle. I click it. Now here's how I figured this one out. I remembered there was a shape that looked kind of like this. So I went back. Look at that. It's the same basic shape. And it's red, green, blue. So I go back. Except that it's kind of a circle shape, right? So red, green, blue. And look at that. Now I got the clip. This took me a while. First, I'm going to get my two sushi. Mm, good. And then I use that thing and it cut the key. And now I have a key and there was one more lock, the fish lock. I click it. I think. <gasps> the final sushi. I'm at number 20. Celebrate. Feed my cat. Feed my cat. Feed my cat. The sushi. Oh, he's so happy. Look at him. Just, I think he actually eats 20 sushi there. <laughs> Did you actually count them as they were going in his mouth? Nice. I have people that counted. And he gets hit in the head with a gong, I guess, at the end. All right, thanks for playing. And you can actually you can actually go to this guy's Twitter page and like subscribe and you can sign up on his mailing list. And he makes a lot of other games that are really cool. And he has an app and it's called Where is Cat? And it basically has this, but other stuff too. So if you like cats and you like this guy's game and the style of art, then you might really like this. Uh, Mr. Uh, what's his name? Bronte? Wait, it's a uh, Bonte. Bonte. Bonte Games. So, um, thank you, Mr. Bonte, for making these awesome games. And that is Mr. G's playthrough of Cats in Japan. Thanks for joining me and have a wonderful day. Signing off.